Before we can now run our multi-touch application, we have to assemble our interface. Now we can click Build and Go, and after a few seconds, we got our first macOS 10 multi touch application running. In the last step, we will now enhance our application by multiple views in a full screen mode. I've got here two more NSU subclasses. They contain exactly the same code as the one we created before, but each uses a different background color. I also got an application delegate class that we use to enter the full screen mode. Now we just have to do some changes in Interface Builder. Click Build and Go, and again, after a few seconds, we got our enhanced multi-touch application. Okay, that's it. Visit our website to find out how to get the beta to start developing multi-touch applications for macOS 10. Thanks for watching.